Braden Shank here at Gulf Fuller Field, joined alongside Nebraska's Dylan Carey after the Falmouth Commodores take down the Bourne Braves by the final score of 4-2. to two. Dylan, good day for you at the plate. Four hits. What was working well for you? Yeah, I mean, seeing the ball well uh, on attack early, I think that's all it was, you know, just being ready to go off the rip. What was going through your mind? Seventh inning, you come up to bat, tie game, ducks on the pond. What was going through your mind during that at bat? Yeah, honestly, I was basically saying, like, there's no pressure here. You know, it's a long summer. If I get out, I get out. If I get a hit, I get a hit. Uh, my teammates, you know, they got my back no matter what. So having that kind of trust uh, made it a lot easier to go up there and, you know, put a ball in play. Lucky got up the middle there, and um, at the end of the day, we got the win. You've been here since game one. How has a team you guys been able to stay level sort of through the losing streak to now be able to win two straight? Yeah, I mean, it's great. I mean, we just continue to trust each other. You know, that, you know, baseball's hard. It's, it's a hard game. So, you know, continuing to trust in one another and understand that, you know, there's always another game. So, you know, we got two games, uh, two back-to-back -back wins. So we're trying to, you know, live off that and, and uh, continue on. Obviously, the Commodores have won two straight. How does that feel? Feels great. Yeah, winning games is awesome. So. Well, the Falmouth Commodores will return to the road tomorrow as they take on the Harwich Mariners, a 631st pitch from White House Field. But until next time, the Commodores take down the Braves 4-2.